वेलकम टू आई ड्रीम मीडिया माय नेम इज़ पद्मावती फ्रॉम शार्प माइंड सबैटस नारायण गुड़ा टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू स्क्वाड्स इजी मेथड ऑफ लर्निंग स्क्वाड्स दिस मेथड इज़ गोइंग टू बी यूजफुल फॉर यूर एकेडमिक्स एंड यू कैन सॉल्व द सम्स इन वेरी इजी मेथड एंड यू कैन गेट द आंसर्स एक्यूरेटली सो वील स्टार्ट विथ ट्वेल्थ स्क्वायर ट्वेल्थ स्क्वायर इज नथिंग बट ट्वेल्व इंटू ट्वेल्व ओके सो हियर वी आर गोइंग टू यूज अ मेथड okay so this method is very easy if you use this method you will get the answers accurately at the same time the time also will take very less to complete this question okay now the first step is there are two steps to follow in squares so first what we will do 2 into 2 so that is the unit place multiplications 2 into 2 will become 4 okay now in the second step we will add this 12 i mean we will take 12 and we will add this 2 It will become 14 okay now for this 14 we will multiply with 1 this will become 14 so the answer is 144 so i'll explain once again see first is 2 into 2 the unit digit multiplication we are going to do That is two into two is four, and in the second step, what we will do? We will take this twelve and we will add two to this. That is the units place. This will become fourteen. So for this fourteen, we will multiply with one. So this will become fourteen into one will become fourteen. <coughs> so we will get the answer as one hundred and forty-four. This sum took hardly one minute to uh, do calculation. So I would uh, request all of you to follow this and follow these steps and solve the sums very quickly and easily. We will do the next sum. So twenty-three square. So twenty-three square is nothing but twenty-three into twenty-three. So the first step will be three into three. Three into three will become nine. Now in the second step. We will add twenty three plus three. This will become twenty six. Okay. Now into two. This will become. So the answer is five hundred and twenty nine. Yeah. So I'll explain this sum once again. So twenty three square twenty three square is nothing but twenty three into twenty three. So first step is we will take the unit digit multiplication that is three into three that will become nine. Okay. Now in the second step twenty three plus this three that is in the units place three. So this will become twenty six into two. So the tens place two we are doing multiplication that will become fifty two. So the answer is five hundred and twenty nine is the answer for this. So the next sum is thirty seven square. So thirty seven square is nothing but thirty seven into thirty seven. So the first step is this two digits that is seven into seven. Seven into seven will become forty nine. So see here this is important. Whenever we get two digits, we have to Carry forward one digit to the next level. Okay, so we got two digits here, so we will carry forward this number that is four, the tens place number to the next step. In the second step, we have thirty-seven plus seven. This thirty-seven, we will add this seven. That is the units place seven. This will become forty-four. Okay. Now into this three, the tens place three. Now we got the answer as one hundred and thirty-two. So this number that is four we will add here. So this will become one hundred and thirty-six. So the answer is one three six and nine. One one three six nine is the answer. So I'll explain this sum once again. Thirty-seven into thirty-seven. Okay. So here seven into seven, the unit digit multiplication. That will become forty nine. Whenever we get two digits, we have to carry forward the first digit to the next step. Okay. 
Now here 37 plus 7 will become 44 into 3. The tens plus 3 we are doing multiplication. So we got the answer as 132. Now the 4, the carry forward 4 we will add it here. So the, that will become 136. And we will add this 9 here. We will, oh yeah. So that will become 1369. This is the answer. Hope that you understood this sum. I will give some examples. I want you to do the uh, sums according to this and uh, let me know in comments. So kindly do these two sums and uh, as per what I have explained you, please use the methodology and solve this sum and please comment about the answers. Thank you.